all for being here. Um, as you can tell, for players and coaches, this is kind of competitive. Um, these guys come here, and I'm telling you, they want to be coached. We have, we have Final Four officials that you will see doing the Final Four officiating the game. Doesn't mean they don't screw up, but let me say this. You get good officiated games, so you can't argue about that. The, the, they come in here, and when I said last night, how many of you guys want to win? Every one of them are here to win, but they know the bigger picture of why we're doing this is that it generates money for charity. Um, if you add up the checks, which some of you may do, I think it's 890 with matching funds, it's over a million dollars again. And we have many of the people here, there were 20 or 21 groups that benefited by this experience, by these players, and by an auction last night that was outrageous. Um, and, and everybody got involved. I mean, to whatever level people could get involved, they did, because they knew that that was what this was about, generating money for charity. Um, I'm really proud of this experience for these campers. When I say campers, I just told them, I said, I, I do this, I did USA Basketball, and as I come in, I go, I'm coaching 50-year-old guys, what am I doing? Like, I need another job. But then after I do it, one, I get into it. And then two, you create relationships and friendships with these guys that go for the next 20 years. And, and again, as we do this, um, we're going to recognize the groups. Do I have something that says, because I will not remember by name. There's 20. Is there anything? Greg, are you here? Um, Chris, why don't you, while you come up here and tell them about this, the comedy mania, okay, that we're going to do too. Um, here, here are the groups. Uh, four Pauls for ability. And I think that's Walt. Where are you, Walt? Walt's in the back. Uh, ALS, are you here today? The a ALS. How many of you did the uh, bucket challenge? Any of you here do the bucket challenge? Which is really neat. Uh, Children's Home of Northern Kentucky. Connecticut Burns Care Foundation, which is for children. Everfine, which is a child's uh, financial literacy group. Fayette County Public Schools Financial Literacy. Golden Door Scholars, which is out of North Carolina. Juvenile D uh, Diabetes Research Foundation, which Scott um, his daughter, we, we told a little story last night. Uh, Kentucky Arm Army National Guard Memorial Fund. Lexington County, um, Fayette County Urban League, and I think PG is here. You hear PG, I see over there, PG Peoples. Uh, Miracle League of Wilm Wilmington, which is a park that was built for disabled uh, war heroes. And it's unbelievable down in Wilmington, North Carolina. One parent scholar home. Um, is Cecil done here? I know that's, a, and I see Luther over there. Red Cross of Bluegrass, Samaritan's Feet, I see Manny. How many of you like what we did with Samaritan's Feet? Is that an unbelievable program? I mean, it's really good stuff, and, and uh, we're, we're there involved. School to Work Council, Starkey Hearing. Uh, is Brady here, or did he take off? Is Brady still here? Uh, Streets Ministries that does unbelievable work in Memphis, Tennessee, and, and, and I had, um, is, that, is uh, Ken Bennett here? I'm not sure. Jeremy Hunt is here. Jeremy, you're going to accept that on behalf of the uh, street ministries. Is he still here? Do you know? Um, St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. Team Focus, which is for boys without fathers. It's an unbelievable year-round program for uh, to really educate and help those kids. And then Team for Kids, which is a program that scholarships kids to camps all over the country. So those are the ones that we've, we've um, earmarked this year. Now, how do we want to do give out checks? How are we doing this? We have to take pictures of you. Okay, so what we're going to do is any, any of you people that are here will take pictures of the, you and your check, um, and we'll do that. And then I'm going to have um, Chris Woolard come up and talk about something that we're doing for Haiti here that's coming up, and I have no idea the date or anything else Chris does, so I'm going to let Chris do this. Come on up, Chris. Hey, 